Hey guys, how is it going? In today's video, we are gonna go to the Chinese classical gardens down in Chinatown in Vancouver. I'm so, so, so excited to go. Um, I'm trying to just do one thing a day because there's not a huge amount of stuff to do here for free or for a low, like, low cost, for a low price. So I'm trying to do one free thing a day and try and stay occupied most of the day. I'm editing videos that should be posted very, very soon. So I'm not gonna waste any more time here. I'm gonna pack up my bag and we're gonna head down to Chinatown. I'm so excited to tour this Costco garden. I've heard so many good things about it. And yeah, I would say one thing that you always have to keep in mind while you're here is dress accordingly and pack accordingly. Even when it is the middle of July, now that I'm coming here, it is cold most mornings. It is only 17, 18 degrees. So you will need a pair of pants. You will need a long sleeve like I'm wearing because it does get chilly and it is pretty gloomy right now, as you can tell. So it might clear up later on in the day and it usually has judging by the last couple of days It's gloomy in the morning and then clear in the afternoon kind of like when I was in Los Angeles but um, Yeah, just bring extra clothes bring long sleeves just because you never know So I've made it into the Chinese classical garden here, and it's just absolutely beautiful Like you don't even feel like you're in the city You can't even hear any of the city and like literally outside of those gates is the downtown city And they even give you this booklet here it gives you like a History of the place And it's beautiful like it's so thoughtfully laid out You can get a map here at the back And it shows you everything You can pause this and look at it if you want to but It's beautiful I'm gonna get some really nice photos here for Instagram and whatnot, so it's gonna be beautiful. Yeah, I'm super excited, and I can't wait to tour this. recommend coming down to this Chinese um, classical garden here down in Chinatown in Vancouver. Um, your tickets are about um, $13, $16 if you're an adult, but the nice man there, I was waiting a long time because I didn't purchase my tickets online. You're supposed to purchase them online. I didn't, but I didn't know that. But yeah, if you're going here for the time being now because of what co is going on with COVID, they want you to purchase the tickets online. I think you even save some money if you purchase them online too. So um, yeah, do that. But I got a cheaper price for my ticket there. It's $13. I got some incredible photos down there. So yeah, this was great. It was a lot of fun. It's a very small place. It's not like, there's not a lot to do there, but there's enough. So, yeah, okay, but this is a pretty cool view. <sighs> wow. You can't deny that's not a cool view. Yeah. I've even got the tower in the background, my hair is messy. You can't deny the view here, it's absolutely gorgeous. It's beautiful, it's cold though. Like, when you're by the water, it does get a lot colder. Um, there's a lot of homeless people around, um, even West Hastings and Gastown. That's why I was like not filming very much there, is because there's a lot of people that are mentally unwell. So yeah, that's something you shouldn't be concerned about, and you shouldn't be like displaying stuff like cameras and stuff. This is an expensive camera, so I'm not taking the risk. Um, yeah, not to be mean, but you know. These people are, have drug addictions and they have bad mental health well, so there's a lot of things that I don't really consider, so, but yeah, this is really pretty, um, I like it here a lot, um, <laughs> and yeah, I'm just kind of browsing around and looking around and um, like touring and just kind of walking down the streets and exploring stuff because that's the best way to explore, I find. Ah, so good morning guys. I'm combining this vlog with yesterday's vlog as well, but we are currently at the Queen Elizabeth Park here. We're going to the observatory behind me as well where there's tropical birds in there. We're gonna get some photos there too, but look at this beautiful, fantastic view we have down here. Like, it's absolutely gorgeous. I'm gonna look down here, like it's so pretty. It feels like I'm in a dream. Look at this hummingbird. It's beautiful. I can't get my camera out in time, so I have to film this on my phone. But isn't that beautiful? Look. Wow. That's absolutely beautiful. 
so later on when I've finished my trip and I come home, I'm going to be making a video of um, five top places you must visit in Vancouver. It'll be five or ten, I don't know. I'd prefer it to be five just because, you know, not everybody has time to do ten things in Vancouver because some people only come for a week. But uh, there's a hummingbird there. Look at that. Oh my god, did you see that? I hope you did. But there was a hummingbird there. Um, but yeah, it's beautiful here. We're gonna go into the observatory and see the tropical birds and uh, just explore and see what's about. It's absolutely beautiful here. It's so pretty. Hi there. Take it here. Do I need to zoom? Oh, no, it worked. Oh, it worked? Okay, thank, thank you. you. You're beautiful. It's so pretty. Look how gorgeous he is. Sitting there. He's not even scared or anything. So pretty. I highly recommend coming to this garden. It's $7.50 for admission. Totally worth it. Have to buy your tickets online though. That's the only thing. So don't show up here because you won't get in unless you book your tickets online. So I don't know if that's a new procedure, but you have to do that. Okay, um, I'm gonna head back to my Airbnb right now. It's starting to spit rain, so it's gonna start pouring rain very, very shortly. So I'm gonna head back there before I get soaked. Yeah, I highly recommend coming out here. Um, lots of tropical birds to see. Like, you've got macaws, you've got cockatoos, you've got all kinds of tropical birds that you wouldn't normally see. And you get to get up really close to them. Um, you can get some like selfies with them and whatnot. You wouldn't get that in a zoo, so it's pretty cool. Um, yeah, as you can hear, the rain is starting to come down now. So I'm going to end this video. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you did enjoy it, please give me a thumbs up here. Subscribe to my channel if you are new and you like tech. And blah, blah. You like tech, travel vlogs, and fun. And I will see you guys in my next video. Take care, and I will see you guys then. I'm going to get soaked. Bye.